The Catholic Diocese of Otupo in Benue State has celebrated 100 years of her existence. The centenary celebration, which brought together bishops, priests, religious and the lay faithful, was an opportunity for the diocese to thank God for the gifts of the Catholic faith to Idoma land. CTV Tony Abba completes the report. What is known as the Catholic Diocese of Otupo today began in 1922 when colonial railway workers brought the Catholic faith to Idoma land in the southern part of Benue State. After 100 years, the Catholic faith has grown in leaps and bounds, covering states like Kogi, Nasarawa, Jos, and some neighboring states within the church jurisdiction. Activities lined up for the centenary celebration of Utupo Diocese included a Thanksgiving Mass offered to appreciate God for the gift of the Catholic faith to the Idoma nation. The Thanksgiving Mass, which was officiated by the Chief Shepherd, Most Reverend Michael Lapochi, brought together bishops, priests, religious, and lay faithful from across the country. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. In his homily, Bishop Apoche gave the historical perspective of how the Catholic faith from Otupo spread to other parts of the country since its arrival in 1922. Our land that encountered the Catholic faith in 1922 extends from Ibumale down to the southern bank of Makoti, down through Angba to some part of Igala land. So our celebration today, and when we talk about our land, is not just limited to the geographical Catholic Diocese of Utupo today. Our joy in the celebration made a review of the impact of the Catholic faith in the environment. And we discovered too that the first set of teachers provided in this environment and even some were sent to help in government college in Kasinala. We are produced from St. Francis College here a college that the church started in 1944. And the history of education in Bremen State, there is no reference to this at all. When we talk about St. Francis Secondary School, it's more or less like a place where they can come and harvest tasks from the students. He also called for the re-evangelization of the diocese for the next hundred years. And we are praying too that where we are joined in the Catholic faith, we should leave a solid foundation to see the church growing from strength to strength in our land. That in about 20, in the next hundred years, people will be there with added Catholic faith to celebrate the 200 years of Catholicity in our land. After the homily, the Offertory and Eucharistic celebration followed. Before the end of Mass, Archbishop of Abuja, Most Reverend Ignatius Kaigama, in his remarks, congratulated the diocese. It is you. You provide the resources. You provide everything we have. If we will succeed, it is you that will help us to succeed. Together with the priests, the catches, the laity, the various church organizations, let's do it together. We are not blessed for the poor die your sins. After the mass, the reception followed. The brigade band presented a spectacular parade to kickstart the ceremony. Members of the Holy Child Unity Dance presented a welcome dance to the delight of all. You can do than life. There were various cultural performances which add colors to the event.
High point of the celebration was the cutting of the centenary cake amidst cheers. Hundred. Put your hands together for them. Put your hands together for them. Some of the dignitaries spoke to CTV News. Hundred years ahead of us, and that needs coordinated action. It needs unity. It needs selflessness. It needs sacrifice. of evangelization we continue to thank God. and what it reminds us is that the future evangelization of this land has become the responsibility of all of us first of all let's just give thanks to God for this great opportunity that we are alive to see a good diocese in a step great 100 years and it's not just about the triple diocese but it's about all of us the Christian faith as for us, so the challenge is not just about the people of Atupo, but also the, well, the people of Atupo here means the bishop, the clergy, the religious, the lay faithful. And I would like to say that we're not too sure um, if some of us will be alive in the next 100 years. <laughs> In Abuja, Tony Abba, CTV News.